at this stage we are at, we are at a state in Pakistan where so-called democratic forces are only interested in coming into office. So ultimately they prop up dictatorships, um, they enable uh, military rule in this country, they enable um, you know, declarations of emergency law, uh, because ultimately for them it's, um, it's a game of, of revolving chairs. As long as they get to be in one of the revolving chairs, they don't care who's in the other one. Dynasty is completely without merit. It's a privilege of birth. So it doesn't enhance the idea of merit or meritocracy in the least. And what it is, is like the rotating military, um, uh, the rotating military um, advances into power. It is also a cyclical and rotating device. And instead of getting, um, you know, a man in uniform, you're just, it, you're, you're getting members of the same family who, who may or may not have um, any real political acumen or may or may not have any real um, political agenda, but only serve um, a personality um, or a family as opposed to a cause. And, and that's ultimately why it's dangerous. It's not only dangerous when it comes to the Bhuttos, it's dangerous when it comes to the Sharifs. And it has to stop being this autocratic, dynastic um, environment. It's got to be opened up to, to, to citizens who, who have a role to play. Uh, but who have not been given access to that space. Um, when the day comes that that this happens, that we have an open field, um, if there is a way for me to serve my country, I would be proud to. Um, but I'm not interested in being a symbol for anyone, and I'm not interested in, in perpetuating um, a really ineffectual form of politics simply because of my name.